And I travel a lot. Homophobia is still a thing, which is crazy. There are still people out there who are afraid that gay people want to have sex with them. Guess what? If you're afraid a gay person wants to have sex with you, you're not their type. <laughs> they have better things to do than try to solve you like a gay Rubik's Cube. Trust me. I loved living in West Hollywood. It was safe and it was clean and it was energetic. My apartment was so gay, it didn't even come with a closet. Like, that's how... <laughs> You couldn't even come out of it. <laughs> the moment you set foot inside, you felt free, and it was incredible. And then there's the people who believe homosexuality is not a real thing, and they always say the same thing. It's Adam and Eve, not Adam and Steve. I'm like, that's the argument you're going with? <laughs> Adam and Eve. Let's see which is more realistic. Let's do a tale of the tape. Adam and Eve, man and a woman, show up stark naked in a garden that isn't theirs. They don't know what they're doing there but they're supposed to avoid a certain tree. What comes slithering out of that tree? Oh, just a talking snake. Offers them a poison apple. They take a bite. Did they die? Nope, they live to be 900 years old. What's more realistic, that? Or just one of your buddies casually saying, hey, you know that dude Eric from the gym? I fucked him, you tell me. Is and then he puts it inside the female octopus and then he swims off to die. So, look, I got a brother, I got a sister, right? For the wedding, 